What's going on guys? Tall Fisherman Jay here and today I am back with another catch and cook. Now I haven't done a catch and cook in a long time. Now that's because I've pretty much caught and cooked every freshwater fish that I probably could. But today we are going to do something that a lot of you really, really enjoyed. Actually to be exact, 1.2 million people enjoyed it. It is my most viewed catch and cook and we are coming back for a part two and that is gar. Now, the first time I had gar, I was so pleasantly surprised with it. It tastes really, really good. Very surprising because gar is not uh, a very appetizing looking fish. They're gross, they smell weird, and they just look kind of odd. But today we are going to try and catch another gar, and we're going to try it again, but we're going to cook it a little bit differently. A lot of people in the comments in the first video told me, oh, you shouldn't pan fry it, you don't get the best flavor. They told me to either grill it or smoke it. So today I am going to try grilled gar. So first we have to catch one. Hopefully we get one quickly. We're gonna head back, try and cut through that thick, thick skin that we all know and love. I kind of hate it. And then we're going to grill it up and then try it again and see how that tastes. Maybe it's a little bit different taste. I'm expecting it to be good, but it's going to be interesting. So stay tuned. Let's go catch some gar. Oh, he's got it. Come on, Mr. Gar. Oh yeah, go away with it. There you go. Go to your home, your time, buddy. Cause you're gonna be dinner. All the fans wanna see it. Oh, we got him. Here we go, boys. Gar catch a cook. Part two, here we go. <laughs> All right guys, so here is our gar that we are going to cook up today. Now, we are going to head back and the challenge is going to be getting through this thick skin. If you guys don't remember from the original video, it was quite the challenge. But we got our Cast King knives with us today. Hopefully it would help us get through this skin quickly and try the meat. So let's go ahead, get back to the house and cut them up. you guys we are back at the house we got our gar pieces here we're gonna go ahead and fire our grill up and try out some grilled gar now before I breaded them pan fried them but this time we're gonna try some nice char grilled style gar we're gonna season them very lightly a little bit of butter and that is it so let's go ahead and get started Turn this bad boy on okay we are in business all right, so our grill top is nice and hot. We're gonna go ahead and throw our pieces right on there. And we are going to add our seasoning afterwards, which is a little bit of onion powder, a little bit of garlic powder, a little bit of adobo seasoning, and a touch of paprika just for some nice color a little more on that bad boy there we go so there are our gar pieces right there they're going to grill up nice we're going to give them about two to three minutes each side this is super hot and they're not too thick and we are done we're going to head over to the table and try them out i am missing one more thing we're going to add a little bit of butter to each one just to keep these pieces nice and moist we don't want them to dry out or anything like that so we're going to add a little butter and they're just going to get cooking i'm going to close this give them a couple minutes and we're done i'm pretty excited all right you guys it's been about four minutes and these fish are done nice golden brown color a little bit of char on the edges which i am okay with because you already know we love burning fish on this channel so we're going to go ahead and take them off plate them 
go to the table, try them out. I'm expecting high things from this fish. Let's do it. All right, you guys, we are back at the table. Man, it has been a long time since the last catch cook, but we are back here with Gar yet again. Now, the first time I caught Gar and ate it, I was expecting a lot less than what I got. It is absolutely phenomenal. I pan fried it, I breaded it, and it was great. If you wanna check out that video, I'll leave a link in the description below, as well as somewhere on the screen right now. You can click that, go check it out. It is my most popular catch cook, and that's why I wanted to try it again, revisit Gar, and cook it a different way. So, we have grilled Gar right here. Now, the color, came out really, really nice. Nice golden brown, nice little grill char on there. Now what I always do is I break it in half, show you the inside, show you the texture of it, the color of it, and I am going to try it. So let's go ahead and break it in front of the camera. So here's the piece right here. It is actually really, really nice. It smells really good, really buttery, not too fishy. Now we're gonna break it and show you the inside as soon as this camera focuses. Come on, there we go. So here is the gar. Wow, look at that. Very, very white inside. Very, very flaky. Definitely, oh my gosh. That is just like pure, pure white. I am super excited to try that out. Look at that, it is just, it tears right out. It's nice and, oh my gosh. Okay, so what we're gonna do <laughs> is we are going to just take a nice bite out of the end of this and see how it tastes grilled. I can smell that grill aspect already from it. It smells so good. So we're gonna go ahead and try it. Grilled Gar, catch and cook, part two. Taste test in three, two, one. Mm. Mm. You guys, this fish is always a big surprise. The texture of it is so good. It's so soft, it's super flaky. The grill aspect definitely does take a little bit of a different taste to it. Now, you have that super grilled taste, that little char, it is so good. It does taste similar to the first time, but I think grilling it definitely changed the taste overall. A plus yet again, the butter helped keep it moist. It's a really good fish. It would probably be good on like pasta or maybe like a sandwich or even just on some rice with some lemon. It is, a good fish all in all. Gar is always surprising. Yet again, I am happy. If you guys ever have a chance to try Gar, definitely try it, catch some, grill it up. It's phenomenal. Tell me how you guys have tried Gar before. In the last video, a lot of you guys were telling me how you cooked it and tried it, and I'm curious to see how you guys do it more. Make sure you leave a comment in the comment section below on if you've ever tried Gar and how you cook it and how you like the taste. That is going to do it for part two of Gar Couch Cook. Now I wanted to cook it a different way and I was pretty happy on how it came out grilled. If you guys enjoy this video, please give it a big thumbs up. It lets me know that you enjoy the content that I create for you. Also, make sure you leave a comment in the comment section below. Let me know what species you wanna see next. Freshwater, saltwater, leave it down below. I do read all the comments and I might pick yours for the next episode. As always, everyone, thank you so much for watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing. Until next time, I will see you later. Say bye. Slap, slap the camera. Slap it. Ugh.